Here's a deep dive into Senator Tim Scott's take on Joe Biden's economic impact. And thank you, Chair Powell, for being with us this morning. Welcome, welcome back. Joe Biden broke this economy. It's been very difficult to fix it. That's about. I want to start with the end in mind. Joe Biden broke our economy. It is very difficult for anyone to fix it. Everyday families are struggling to put food on the table. Uh, real wage growth is being eaten away by rising prices and runaway inflation. Think about the fact that for 52 consecutive weeks in the Joe Biden, wages were eclipsed by inflation for 52 consecutive paychecks. I remember back in December 2020, South Carolina gas was $1.99 per gallon. Today, it's still $3.19 per gallon. A 50% increase in just a few years. So it's devastating to the average American family, particularly families like the one I grew up in, a single parent household mired in poverty. When you see your gas prices up 50%, your food up 30%, your cost of keeping your house cool or warm up 25%. It's not a challenge. It's not unfortunate. It's an absolute crisis. And too many households in America today are living paycheck to paycheck. And they fear the challenges that are coming our way, the headwinds brought to us by the Biden administration. Scott emphasizes the power of personal responsibility and the importance of economic self-sufficiency. He strongly believes that Biden's policies have worsened the economy, causing the prices of essential goods and services to skyrocket. This current economic predicament, according to Scott, stems from misguided government intervention. He underscores the necessity for sound economic strategies to foster growth and stability. Scott's comments highlight the practical struggles faced by everyday Americans particularly those from marginalized communities. He appreciates the importance of individual life experiences and advocates for policies that support people's ability to thrive and meet their fundamental needs. The emotional and mental toll of economic hardships is significant. Rising costs and economic instability heighten stress, anxiety, and despair among those striving to make ends meet. These economic pressures not only impact mental health, but also strain family dynamics and overall well-being. Public reaction to Scott's remarks has stirred the political discourse. Biden's narrative of economic failure resonates with many, particularly those directly affected by rising prices and stagnant wages. The effectiveness of this rhetoric in rallying political support and shaping public perception of economic policy is notable. Scott also touches on how economic policy and leadership influence public trust and confidence. The perception of economic competence and accountability plays a crucial role in voter behavior and political leanings. Effective leadership and policymaking are seen as essential to restoring economic stability and addressing the struggles of families in distress.